Oh my god, you guys. I just <laughs> spend so much time filling with this stupid hinge and getting all the screws in. And then uh, I realized I put it on upside down. So double check. Always double check before. Say measure twice, cut once. Look at it twice before you do anything. Ugh. Okay guys, so here we are, the finished product. I do have my flash on right now um, because the lighting here is quite warm toned and I'm gonna be switching it out to cooler tone. So it's kind of just gonna change the appearance of the color. Um, and I have three different knobs on here right now because I'm trying to decide if I want to go like a brassy vibe or um, stick with the silver or this one's kind of, it's the really old one that has been on one of them. And oh, there's a little chip there. I need to touch that up. Um, it's like wood. But I'm um, not going to lie. The color did not turn out how I thought it was going to. Um, and... Something I didn't foresee was that it was going to bring out all of the pink tones in our countertop and I thought it was going to bring out the greys. So here we are, but sometimes that's how it goes. Um, we are planning on switching out this countertop in the next little bit anyways, as well as maybe the um, faucet and either switching out the um, that mirror or I mean, my DIY, some sort of... Um, trim or like border to put around it to kind of bring in the other um aesthetics of the room and we're definitely switching out this 1998 uh light fixture because that's not what my life is about right now um but yeah overall um i just want to point out the finish so this is with two coats there are a couple of spots that i went through and did little touch-ups um more so on Kind of the sides um when i wasn't really looking with a proper light at it and was just kind of like haphazardly doing it before i just went through and made sure it was nicely finished on the tops um but when i was pulling up the tape on some of the edges this one in particular because it's a very awkward space look at right there too um the tape peeled back like the corner of it and then it um, some of the tape actually, oh, there's a piece, um, it was kind of like, it's stuck under the ledge here, see? And then, look at that's how it peels down. Um, so I don't know if that's, it's a paint and primer in one, this Bear brand, but I don't know if maybe if I should have done a primer underneath. I know this isn't, um, this kind of like a Malamine with a sort of like glossy cover on it. Um, I did put, uh sandpaper like it rubs sandpaper on it to rough it up before but I'm wondering if maybe that wasn't enough so I'm gonna go through and touch this up you honestly you can't see that part when you're from here but you can see that line looking a little janky um as well as I got a little trigger happy on the corner here so I'll touch that up but overall um the process is pretty pretty simple and um like I said color's not what I thought it was but I don't think it's the worst. Um, I'm gonna change out some of the decor in this space anyways. Um, so I'll just kind of bring in colors that complement this, maybe bring in some blush pinks, kind of mauve tones. Um, and I already had this vase with um, some flowers in another room. Um, so we're just gonna work with it. Hope you enjoyed the process.